here's off. We're outside of Llano, Texas. These are Angus Pluses, okay, off one ranch. What they are is Angus, Brangus Pluses. They all have a tick here, all one race. The guy sells bulls off this ranch. No, he's a he's registered and commercial. These are Angus Pluses. They are roughly 160 total, about 120 this ranch, another 30, another ranch. So, yeah. They're the real deals. All have a flick of ear in them. I mean, they won't take away from your cat quality or calves, but they all do have a flick of ear. You really can't tell. Look at your shape. You really can't tell unless you know any better. They have any ear in them at all. Like I say, but a, a lay person, these are Angus cross it, Angus type. But look at ears. They're a little bigger than your normal Angus. They have a little more navel. So they have stick of navel. But they are one ranch, one deal. A good example out there. Here's. Two heifers there, heifer in front of us, you can tell she has her ear shape, heifer there, she has a, just a tick of nails. This ranch sells bulls off this ranch. The Seminole Indians there in Florida, they buy 150 of these bulls a year from Texas, and they swear by them. Uh, good functional females, bagging up, they're about to start dropping babies here directly. They're all spring calves on a calf, March, April, and uh, maybe the first week of May, they said, but she probably knocked out. Pretty tight fashion. Eight in the cab window. Now start capping. Her, she's already making back. Obviously, you can see there are docile, docile, docile. I have pictures of their bull mates, the brothers, their older brothers. Whoo, man, there, there are some phenomenal bulls. Of the rancher at once, just a tick of ear. You know, can't do full ear, but once it's a flick of ear and don't want to take away, but that, that has some bulls that are hardy, tough. These are the kind. You know, they're bull mates. These have to be the same way. They can make them south, they can make them further the north. You know, everywhere go, they're just thrifty, thrifty, thrifty. You know, if you're up a northern ranch or one tech, you want to take around west Colorado, you know, dump them out. So tough country out there, and they'll do just fine. Wy boys in Wyoming, again, you can't, they're calves, they're not going to show any ear. Breed them semi, Maine, Charlotte, Herf. You won't tell any ear in their calves. This first generation, they're bred to their, their brother, their mates to them, per se. Not brothers, but mates to them, they're bred to them.